mail time at Sam's Bikes. I thought, riders, I would show you what's arrived in the last 10 days. I am a lucky guy. Some of this stuff I bought, but also some of this stuff I've been gifted. So let's check it out. Number one for the gifts this week is an Insta360 camera. A couple of weeks ago, you might have seen my crazy footage of me riding the Kineva SL with a camera mount off the front. Pretty cool footage. Well, Insta360 saw that. They reached out and said, hey Sam, maybe you wanna try our new action camera. And here it is. Check out this rider, it's so small. It's the InstaGo 2. It's an action camera. And let's open it here. Check out that. It's a magnet. So I'm not sure, I'm gonna to have to do some testing if you can actually put it on your t-shirt. So you put the, the magnet underneath your, t your riding jersey and then this clicks on. I'm not sure how that's gonna work. I reckon for what we're doing for our type of riding, we'll probably still need a, like a proper chest mount. But this is crazy. It weighs like, feels like, I, I mean, it doesn't weigh anything. It's like maybe 30 grams, 50 grams. It's super cool and I'm really interested in testing it. I'm not 100% sure it's gonna take over my GoPro 9, but it might. Super handy and small. But I kind of see it for someone like a weekend warrior, someone just going out for the weekend that just wants to record a little bit of action, share it on Facebook, share it on Insta, show their parents, show their girlfriend, show their friends. So this could be a great option. So really excited to try this out. And they also sent me, it's like a, a bundle kit, so different mounts, and also a selfie stick. So in the coming weeks, I'm gonna be testing it. I probably will do a little bit back to back with the GoPro 9. So I know a lot of people are thinking about getting a new action camera for the summer. So definitely that's not a bad option. And number two, a pressure cleaner from Muckoff. I've been wanting to do a video on how to clean your e-bike properly. I reached out to Muckoff six months ago and we spoke a little bit and then nothing. And this arrived in the post this week with no email, no note, no nothing really. So this is amazing and Muckoff, thanks so much. I will be doing a video soon and I really can't wait to test this. And also riders, the worst thing about YouTube for me is cleaning bikes. So this is definitely gonna come in handy. And what else do we have? All right, we have some, let's have a look in the box. We have some brand new Sam Hill pedals. A Couple of weeks ago, I actually broke my Sam Hill pedals. Though I actually lost a few pins and the nice guys at Chain Reactions just sent me another pair out. So shout out to Chain Your Actions. And anyone looking at getting some good flat pedals, the Sam Hills are amazing, I love them. They're a little bit sharp, but super good. And the gifts are over now, everything else is paid for fully, stuff I need for the summer. And a massive shout out to Muckoff, Chain Your Actions, and Insta360 for all this stuff, can't wait to test it. And the new helmet, a lit helmet. A couple of weeks ago, I had an off and I broke the gyro switchblade, unfortunately, so that had to be retired. So new helmet. And with COVID, there's not that many options out there. And this was kind of like my third choice, but it looks pretty good and I'm, I'm interested in testing it. It doesn't have MIPS, but I think it looks like a good helmet and it gets good reviews. So let's check that out. Thought I'd go blue and red and a bit of gold. Uh, let's go in for the fit. Yeah, nice fit. A little bit loose, but I think you have chin pieces in here to tighten it up. So I'll be looking forward to testing that. Let's put that over here. And what else do we have? New knee pads, because with the camper van, I'm having to keep a set in the camper van and a set here, so they're handy. And these are bigger knee pads, more sort of downhill super enduro knee pads. And riders, I found a spare chain. Super difficult to find, but you know, you need a spare chain over the summer. And what else is in here? Two quick links. Riders, make sure you have quick links for your summer holidays. And we've got some power bar isoactive, which is like, like a carbohydrate energy drink. Uh, it means you don't have to eat while you're riding. And I want to try this out. I think it should be good. And some Troy Lee skeleton gloves. 
I actually bought these for Nico, the Aussie punter, but I reckon they might be a little bit small for him, so I might get them. They look, they look super cool. And a Blackburn plug. I had a flat tire the other day with the Magic Mirror and I used all my plugs. And also, because I got two bikes, I wanted one on each bike. So, got that. Got some, this is carbon fiber paste for when I'm doing work on the bike. Some new emergency tire boots from Park Tool. I actually can't find all of mine and I wanna keep, there's three in this pack, I wanna keep one in each backpack. Uh, oh, some new sunglasses. You know I'm a sucker for sunglasses. And I saw these the other day, the Oakleys, and I just thought I had to have them. Check out that. What do you reckon, riders? Looking good or what? Yeah, super comfortable. Uh, quite dark, actually, so really good summer glasses. Yeah, I like them. Really good. A Magura bleed kit. I don't know how, but I misplaced my bleed kit. You definitely need a bleed kit if you go on holidays. I've got both my bikes set up with MT7, so I definitely need a bleed kit. Uh, what else we got in here? Some spare plugs. And I think that might be, ah. No, I got some, uh, some 38 air tokens, three of them, just because I want to start playing around with suspension setup. Should be doing a video in the next couple of weeks of, you know, kind of getting that bike more tuned. I'm definitely not a suspension expert, but I hope to get someone that helps me set it up and we'll do a video on that. And riders, that is it. Loads of stuff happening at Sam's Bikes in the coming weeks, so don't forget to subscribe, share it with like-minded people. We've got Brooke McDonald, the Bulldog, coming on eTalk next week. We're also testing Bayer's Klein e-bike, the retro e-bike. Also, the long-ish term review of the Trek Rail, where I did five days of riding pretty much back to back, and loads more riders. So stay safe out there, and I'm gonna see you next week.